Hi and welcome to this quick tutorial where we're gonna take a look at two ways in which you can add custom CSS in Drive Team Builder and you can either add it to an individual page or post from a Drive Team Builder template or you can add it to the entire team. We're gonna start with adding custom CSS to a post or page through a Drive Team Builder template. So for that I'm gonna access my Drive Team Builder dashboard and go to the templates section. I'm gonna hover over one of my templates. I'm gonna go for the default page template and click on edit and the Drive Team Builder editor will open. Once the template has opened in the editor, we will need to find the class of the element that we want to add the custom CSS for. As a really simple example, let's change the color of this title. So as you can see right now, the title is white and we can see it right here in the color section of this text element. So as I said, we will need to find the class for this text element. And for that, we are going to preview the page using this button right here. And I'm going to open the DevTools and locate the elements class. And for that, I can simply select this text element, right click on it and click on inspect. As you can see, the DevTools has opened and the class of the element will be right here on the right hand side. So as I said, we want to change the color, which is going to be right here. And I'm going to click on this color square, which represents the current color of my text element. And I'm going to use the color picker to select a different color. You can click anywhere outside the color picker and right away we can see that the color has changed. So what I'm going to do now is copy this section that contains the new color applied to my text element and then I can go ahead and close this tab. Right away we can see that the color of the text has been changed on this page. I'm gonna go back to my Drive Team Builder template. All right, so we're back on the template, but as I said, we are making modifications to the page from this template. So what I'm going to do is access the Drive Architect Editor from this section right here so that we can add custom CSS to this specific page. And now from the right sidebar, I'm gonna access the settings section, go to advanced settings, and custom CSS. Now the custom CSS layout will pop up on your screen as you can see, and you can start typing the CSS. But since I've just copied the text element class with the color changed, I'm going to simply paste everything here. And if necessary, make sure to also add a bracket at the end, just like in my case. So now we can click on this check icon right here to save the modifications and as you can see the color has already changed using custom css and of course save the page when you're finished so this is how you can easily apply custom css to a page or post from within a drive team builder template now as i said we can also add it globally throughout the entire team and let's go ahead and access our wordpress admin dashboard to see how to do that all right, so we're back in the WordPress dashboard. I'm gonna go to the left sidebar and hover over appearance and go to the customize section. This section will open and as you can see on the right hand side, you will see a preview of your website and the left sidebar will contain some options. The last option found here is the additional CSS one. And if we click on it, we're gonna see that a field will open where you can add your custom CSS. We can take the same example so I can easily change the color of the title, but this will affect my entire website. So all of the matching titles will change their color if we do this. So we can do the same as in the other example. We can change the color using the DevTools tab and the color picker and then copy the class of the text. And we can simply add this CSS right here. And if we want to save the changes, we can go ahead and publish. And then if we go ahead and navigate through our website, we're going to see that for each title, the color has been changed. So as we can see, the modifications have been applied globally on the entire team. So these were two ways in which you can add custom CSS through Drive Team Builder, either on a single page or post through a template or team wide. As always, feel free to check out the rest of the tutorials and articles from our knowledge base and from our YouTube channels to get even more familiar with the various Drive Suite features and options. Oh.